And the Humane Society of Greater Dayton is visiting now the hardest hit areas, making sure that people have what they need to care for their pets in this time of need. And two news reporter Ian Fitzgerald continues our team coverage with that. Well, in the days since the tornadoes, there has been a steady stream of donations coming to the Humane Society. Obviously, one of the main focuses is humans. So now the Humane Society is deciding to mobilize their units, bringing the aid to the people who can't even leave their house out of fear. Of course, there are a lot of people who aren't getting out enough because of uh, no transportation, because they're, they're scared that their homes are going to be looted, because of all kinds of things. Uh, maybe they're there trying to take care of their pet and they can't leave their pet alone. Because of all the uncertainty in tornado impacted areas, the Humane Society loaded up vans to distribute pet food, cages, beds, cat litter, and even the Humane Society's medical staff. Many of our vets are going out in the community today, and so um, we'll, we'll figure out if, if there's a need out there, then we can address it. The supplies were distributed in Trotwood, Dayton, and Beaver Creek. The Humane Society is also offering free microchipping in case storm victims want an added security measure for their pets. If you are missing a pet or know someone that is missing a pet post-tornado, call the Montgomery County Animal Resource Center. Ethan Fitzgerald, 5 on 2.